Hey guys, I wanted to talk a little bit about the wheelchair that I use. Um, I've had a couple questions about it. Um, this is the uh, Tylite ZRA. It's uh, actually the only wheelchair I've had so far. I've only been in a chair for two years. So this is what I was initially set up with, uh, straight out of rehab. Um, I got the black frame. I'm kind of one of those guys who likes everything black. <laughs> um, when I first got this chair, it had big, goofy gray wheels on it. Um, I ended up getting these. These are uh, Spinner G LX wheels. Um, with just black spokes and the Marathon Plus tires. They're a lot skinnier and smaller um, than the initial tires that came on this chair. Um, you can see it's, this chair is adjustable. Um, you can adjust you know, how high the back you know, sits up off the ground and you can also adjust the casters and stuff like that. So I've kind of tweaked it and played around a little bit with it um, just to uh, you know, see how you know, when I probably get my next chair I won't get an adjustable chair. Um, so, with this I'll know exactly how I want my next chair set up. Uh, let's see, I use this bag on the front, um, you know, since I'm sitting on my butt all the time, obviously I keep my wallet, um, you know, anything I would need to take with me I keep in this bag, as opposed to in my pockets or anything like that. Um, the cushion that I use is a J2 cushion, it's a gel filled cushion. I'm not real psyched about it. I kind of am paranoid because if this gel busts, you know, I'm basically sitting on nothing but hard foam. So I'm kind of thinking about getting um, maybe a, I don't really want an air filled cushion or anything like that. I'm thinking maybe get um, like a honeycomb cushion. Um, I actually have a, a rigid back. Uh, this is a J3 backrest that, <laughs> this backrest used to be blue. It used to be like a blue color. I took fabric dye and dyed this black to obviously match the rest of the chair. Slap that tie light badge on it just for the heck of it. Um, but what, like I said, what I like about this backrest is that I think with me being such a high injury, I'm a T1, uh, I think it just helps with my posture. Um, I work with somebody who's in a wheelchair that has um, a sling back and she said that when she tried my chair out, she thought this was a lot, lot better for, you know, somebody who sits in an office all day. Um, you know, you're, you want to be in the best posture that you can be. Um, these uh, handles actually flip down. And the good thing about this is when I'm sitting in the chair, these aren't always up in my armpits all the time. I really like the fact that I can fold those down. Not to mention, it kind of lets people that are, you know, with you, <laughs> they, they don't want to push you as much. They don't, you know, they don't want to, you know, do that as much as, um, you know, you'd think if these were sitting up all the time, people would always, you know, be like, oh, let me push you, let me help you out. So uh, I kind of like that factor. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Oh yeah, one more thing I wanted to mention. This leg strap keeps, obviously, keeps my legs from falling off the back of the footrest. One problem I was having with this, uh, since it's Velcro, you know, they would always rip off. Say, uh, you know, I was trying to push through a doorway or something, these would always rip off. So what I did was I took um, zip tie straps. I just cut little holes and just zip tied them around. So this thing will never fall off anymore. Um, so yeah, um, another thing I have uh, scissor brakes, or I think that's what they're called, but you actually, to lock them, you lock them from underneath the chair. I like that just because they're a very, very solid brake and you don't have anything when you're doing transfers sticking up um, you can get caught on so i think that's cool um, that's pretty much it that's my wheelchair just wanted to share that with you if you have any questions uh, just let me know thanks a lot